Here we go again. So, you know I had a really bad brow microblading experience about a year ago. I don't know if we filmed about it or not. I, I, don't, I don't think we did, because I was so pissed off. Anyways, it's taken a year of lasering to get that mess off. And this past year, we've had to actually cover my brows with makeup and pencil them in and create the brows that I've always wanted. And so, Finally, we are at a stage now where we are actually at a microblading place today. It's called the Rose Rose Brow Lounge, I believe. A lot of my friends come here, so it was highly recommended. So we are going to be getting new microbladed eyebrows finally. Yeah! Say yes, Mr. Fabulous. Yes, finally. <laughs> it's gonna cut our time in half. <gasps> Big time. Oh, I know, so finally we won't have to pencil in and create a brow anymore on my eyebrows. So um, hopefully you're not too squeamish and you won't mind seeing this video today because we're going to kind of show you how we are going to have new brows created finally. We're going to fill this in with some strokes. Mm -hmm. It'll be like a curve. It won't go up to this little point right here. Yeah. It'll just be a curve. It'll go with your neck. You've got uh, your hair kind of just goes to uh, the, yeah. that natural curve. So we want the same thickness here and here. So basically just one straight line. That's the Kylie Jenner look, like that big bold front. So we'll just fill in all this right here where you had it done before. We're so all it's not too thick. No, this is essentially, it's the only like more thickness that you're getting because look, these little stri strokes come right down to this line. Mm -hmm. They, this part must have just faded. Mm -hmm. um, so we're basically going with that same thickness okay. and we're adding an arch. Okay. We're adding that tip right yeah. there. Um, this black line is covering all that yellow yeah. that you had before. So a little bit right here and up this arch. Similar over here, all this right here. It was done before and that's a really good like bottom line. Mm -hmm. um, we're just filling all that in and we're coming up a little on that arch. Mm -hmm. So, And then right here, I guess this, this must have just faded before because we'll be adding right there. But yeah. Again, this comes right down to that line. Mm -hmm. So we're not going to be adding to what you... Uh, had before it was actually essentially be a little thinner. Yeah. Yay! Hi everybody, my name is Kelly at Rose Brow Lounge. We are gonna do a color correction and touch up on Teresa. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully, I'm numb. <laughs> she's done some color removal, and so we're just gonna try and camouflage the old ink with the uh, lizard areas. Um, they're a little blue gray, so we'll do some warmer colors. Uh, to combat that and then we'll give her a nice little extra arch for a little facelift and yes. yay! She's yes. gonna have some brows when she leaves. Yay! <laughs> so excited! No more penciling in. Yeah. <laughs>
Look at that. We have a nice little arch oh too. Oh my gosh. I we have a eyebrows. little sparse in the, in the middle yeah. so that they're a little spaced out and a little more dense out of so the So is tape. that my actual hair or is that a old tattoo? That's an old spot. Okay. And this is, yeah, this is an old spot and this is uh, your new spot. So I have these first two strokes. How am I going to get rid of that old spot? <laughs> yeah, we got to let that fade out. Oh my god. Look. <laughs> I have eyebrows. <laughs> I don't have messed up eyebrows. Yay, like they are so amazing. And it did not hurt at all. I would highly recommend the Rose Brow Lounge here in Houston. Um, I think it's in the the Kirby. No. Afton Oaks or Highland Village area. Highland Village area, yeah. So if you're familiar with Houston and you're familiar with Central Market, <laughs> you're like only a few blocks away. Um, she is amazing. Her spa here is beautiful. It did not hurt. I was like, I was so surprised because I've had some bad experiences, guys. I mean, this whole past year I've had laser done to remove the mess that the other girl created. It was horrible. Um, so, funny thing is, as I found out, uh, quite a few of my girlfriends come here too. So, that's the best thing is when you go somewhere where word of mouth, like if your girlfriends go to you, yeah, <laughs> then she must be pretty good because my girlfriends are very picky. So. I knew that if they went here, she had to be pretty good. So anyways, like I said, if you're in the Houston area and you're looking to get your brows done, hello. <laughs> I wouldn't go anywhere else but here. So leave your comments below. Let me know what you think. I know some of you are like, leave your face alone. I'm like, whatever, get off my channel. So um, I wanted better eyebrows, so I came and got better eyebrows today. So. If you like what you saw today, leave your comment below. Hopefully it wasn't too grotesque watching. I wasn't aware of what it was looking like. Only my <laughs> Mr. Fabulous back there. <laughs> Not too bad. It wasn't too bad. It wasn't too much blood or anything. Mm -hmm. So, um, like I said, leave your comments below. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you hit that notification bell so you get these messages about every time I upload a video. So, with that said, I hope you enjoyed it. How do you feel? Oh my god. I mean like seriously guys, I've had microblading done numerous times in the past, I would say 10 years, okay? Um, of course my last experience was the worst. It was a nightmare. And now, thank god we've got them fixed and I've got new eyebrows. But I would have to say out of all my experiences I've had in the last 10 years, this was the most enjoyable. It was the least amount of pain, uh, no mess hardly at all. Um, and I love how they turned out. The right color. I mean, like, this experience was phenomenal. Really, I mean, like, really good. I mean, seriously, I cannot right. brag enough about how amazing this lady is. Like, the Rose Brow Lounge, guys, is the place to go. It's very private. It's very beautiful. It's, like, right out, like, this is what it looks like outside her area, right? I mean, like, it's so pretty. Yeah. Um, and this is a sponsor, like this is like a really good This service. was not like, sponsored, I paid for my brows, I mean like, you like know. Such good service, it's like so I didn't, calming. No, I know, I mean so like calming. the whole spa experience, her, she's very professional, she knows what she's doing, she's an artist at work. I'm telling you guys, it doesn't get any better than what I just went through just now. I mean like, and like I said, this was not sponsored, I paid for my brows. Um, she offered to let me have them for free and I said, oh hell no, no, I'm, I'm paying for my brows. Like, girl, you're worth every penny. And she's reasonably priced. She's right there with anybody else. So it's, it's so worth it. Like, I cannot wait to come back in six weeks and get my touch up. Um, just because I'm so happy to have exciting new pretty brows. Oh my yes. god. Trust me, all your makeup artists are excited. <laughs> I know, I know, right? Dre, oh, can you imagine Dre? She's oh, gonna be like, yes. oh my god, I don't have to pencil in your eyebrows anymore. <laughs> yes. So definitely recommend her.